it's exciting. This is the fun part. Opening the lockers is fun. Ah, oh, yes. This is the one I like. Ship's wheel. Oh, very cool piece. What's this right here? <laughs> that's funny. Yep, and that's a really good sign. Whoa! Dun dun dun! To you. Little drum roll here, guys. It's got a blanket protecting something. Oh, okay. Whoa! Interesting. Made in Norway. Heck yeah. See more glass. Oh, that is beautiful. And what's this? Looks like a safe. You didn't even mention that? I said that earlier. All right, guys, are you ready? It's locker time. We're gonna get, well, okay, we got in that locker yesterday. We're gonna go in there and just clean the stuff out. We've already been through everything, but just like four doors down, we've got another locker. We only peeked in that last episode. If you guys didn't see it, go back and watch that because this one was interesting. I can't say it was great. We definitely found interesting stuff in there, but no like big, big ticket stuff, no home runs, nothing like epic, but of the two same owner the first one was the one i most wanted that's the one i bought first i bought this one only because it was the same owner and i had to have them both just in case just in case right but this one i didn't want as much today we're getting to the one that i most wanted the one that i have a gut feeling on let's see if it's right it's not telling me right now if i'm right or not it leaves me wrong very often like every time it says you're hungry it's lying to me. It's not telling me the truth. I know that, so I don't always listen to my gut, but this time I did. Let's go see. Let me get this one cleared out, and then let's go check that one. You see I got the big trailer today. Big truck, big trailer. Okay. Yeah. Unfortunately, I also have a big load already. That sucks. So my mom's moving. A lot of that stuff is hers. Some of that stuff is other oh, stuff. I don't even remember from what, but lockers, stuff that people give me because they're cleaning out their lockers, and uh, a lot of stuff from my mom's house. So we got two five by tens. They got to fit it in here. We got to fit it. But anyways, no more talking. Let's get to work. Okay. That's how I left it yesterday. It looks pretty good. If you guys didn't watch it, really go back and watch it. We've got toolboxes, interesting trunks. Found a few treasures in there, surprisingly. But uh, yeah, let me just get this cleared out. All right, guys, just a few minutes later. Dun 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 dun. We are done with number one. And I think we are gonna get them both in here because I don't know, just kind of came together. Well, okay, I still got a whole bunch of stuff spread out here. But yeah, let's get into this one right here and then I'll move the trailer back. We'll start, we'll start getting in there. You guys ready? Are you ready? Ooh, it's exciting. This is the fun part. Opening the lockers is fun. Ah, oh, yes. This is the one I like. All right, do you guys like it? Put in the comment below if you like this one. Uh, and, and even if you didn't watch the last one, or if you did watch it, don't let that one, you know, persuade you to say yes or no on this one. Just look at this one on its own merits and say, I like it. Or you could say, I don't like it at all. <laughs> I'm not going to be offended. The locker's not going to be offended. Maybe someone else reading is going to be offended, but who cares, guys? Give me your opinion. Let it fly. All right, let me move this trailer. Start digging. All right, guys. I'm ready. I'm ready. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's see what's in here first of all. Looks like some rags. Make sure there's no wads of cash <laughs> rolled up inside. Yeah, there's a nail. <laughs> okay. Now this. I think I did peek in here yesterday. And yeah, it looks kind of interesting, doesn't it? I think it does. tools okay to, like electrical stuff okay truck papers and receipts maybe they need that i got a box here personal stuff i'll just keep adding to it this box is heavy there's definitely more than clothes in here let's, let's get to the bottom of it a little pun there a little dad pun there's a leather belt vintage looks kind of cool is there a market for that hmm this one 
And you know what? I'm gonna put it aside. I said this in the last video, if you guys watched it, you heard me say it already, but when I bring leather belts to the market, it's like one of the first things people pick up. Ooh, this is cool. This is cool. Gildan, okay. I don't think it's that old, but Rebel Racing, no limits. That's pretty dope. I like it. That's definitely going to the side. We'll make a little better, like better stuff box. Definitely love the vintage tees. This one, it's just for the loom. A little towel, towel rack, this is nice. Beware of dog. Okay. All right, we're gonna use some of our black and yellow totes here just for transferring, just to speed things up till we have an empty box to work with. That's a hoodie with leather, I think. Dockers. Ooh, Lucky brand. Dungarees. I like Lucky clothes. Size 36. Too big for me. Those are kind of neat, though. I'm going to put those aside. We'll bring it to the better market. We got, So we're going to sort stuff, guys, here for a few different flea markets. Banana Republic. That's nice. Double X. Yeah, we'll let it go. Yeah, we got some towels here. Some chain. Towels always sell. What's this? It's kind of neat. Just a little neat. Wow, I, th I really thought there was gonna be more in here because it felt heavy. There's not. What's this? Rustler. There's Faded Glory. Looking for Levi's, of course, and uh, a few other things like True Religion. Some some jeans that sell for better than others. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm really interested to see what's in these boxes right here. Or I guess box. This is something different. Uh, it looks like, oh man, I can think I can see a blanket in there. There's, there's something hard underneath the blanket. This is really one of the reasons why I bought the locker, this right here. Uh, when we were poking around, last time I pulled this out, I did not see this in the photo. The ship's wheel. Okay, let's just get that out right now. Ship's wheel. Oh, very cool piece. Very cool. If I'd seen that, I would have been... Actually, if I'd seen this, if this was shown in the photo, I think the locker actually would have gone for more. Oh, guys, I didn't even tell you how much this went. If you didn't watch the last one, we paid 530 bucks for this. Actually, I may have said 550 in the last episode when I went back. I realized that was wrong. I was so wrong. I don't think this is a real ship's wheel. I think it's just like for decor. Decor. No, don't fit in there either. Uh, kind of neat though. Definitely that'll go to a better market, I think. I like unusual stuff. I like good stuff. Uh, this right here is nice. See, this is like a, I think it's like a shelf. I think it's a big shelf. Um, or it might be a countertop, like, I don't know. What else do we see? This is good. We got some jack stands. I actually might use those for my trailer. I might keep them. I always sell them when I find them. Now I've got a trailer I could actually use those. This, I think, is, look at this. Just a whole bunch of garbage bags. Can use that. I don't buy lockers for that, but I, I don't mind it. Down here, it looks like we got uh, a lot of tools. I see Ryobi. I see some electrical stuff here. Some metal maybe toolboxes what's this right here <laughs> that's funny a little viking wood piece some someone's custom jobber there can't say that's like a fine art piece or nothing but it's interesting it'll go to stockton though so we're going to sort for the, our different markets and uh we've got a good flea market we have like a regular flea market we bring the bulk of our stuff of course we're really trying to sort out the bestest stuff i know that's not a word just trying to be funny our bestest stuff Glass, glass jar there. Okay, there's a flare. Some more tools right here. I'm trying to find better stuff to go into our live auction, guys. That's that's our ultimate goal. Is to pull out good stuff for our live auctions. That's where we're gonna. That's where we make our money. And there's a lot of boxes in here, so that's. I'm really hoping we're gonna find our better stuff in the boxes right or maybe on the shelves here but right now i'm looking i'm seeing a lot of tools the guy was a handyman like he had he was a professional handyman i uh, found business cards that he had fishing line a plastic tarp there for painting that's good a lot of tools the tools sell good in our stockton flea market they sell really good actually uh, there's a vacuum cleaner yeah, looks all right it's a dyson or a shark or something that'd sell for much better but something like this whatever it's kind of a neat piece right there. I like it. I don't think I have any use for it. It looks like it was probably mounted on top of something. Ooh, there's a neat box right there. Look at that metal trunk right there. Okay.
And this is neat right here. I actually really like that piece. It's different. You usually don't see these little tiny drawers like this. A little bit more tools. Hmm. That's nice. We already got one right here, but I think I'm going to upgrade. I'll keep the bigger one. Ooh, look at this. That is cool. Unfortunately, the tip got broke off. Looks like he tried to sharpen the tip. He kept his blade sharp. I like the little ring thing here. Ooh, that's cool. Okay, I'm going to put that aside because that's a neat. It's a little different. I'll, I'll put it in there. We'll make that our keeper box. It smells like uh, tools. Like it's got that greasy smell and you see a little staining here. I think he kept like tools or nails or something in it. That's a cool piece. Very neat little unit right here. I like it. Yeah, that's a, this is a nice flatbed right here. I like that. Actually, it looks like it's made for something. It's got this like recess areas right here. Bimbo Bakeries. Okay, okay, yeah. Probably some kind of bakery boxes going top. It's kind of funny because I got a couple flat beds right there. I don't remember why I put those in the trailer. I like them. And this, of course, I didn't even talk about it, but this uh, mobility scooter. I have found two of these before. I've never found one with keys. So this one appears to have a key right here. Yep, and that's a really good sign. Whoa! Whoa. Oh, that is really, look, it's got a full charge. I was not expecting that, but you know what? Come to think of it, all the, everything we found so far with batteries in it has worked. Battery's not dead. It's just so surprising. To be hand carried to front seat of Kelly's truck. It is fragile. You know what? I thought this was a sconce. I thought that mounts to the wall, but now I see that it's something to go on the desk, I guess. That's a lamp and that is, different i thought this is a walk <laughs> in the photo i thought it was the top of a walk but i thought it was a very interesting little handle this is this is curious so now this is definitely something i'm going to put aside because to me it looks mid-century and it looks a little different um hmm will that fit in here Ooh, ooh, ooh barely mm -mm, i don't like that all right we're gonna put it in the truck make sure we don't damage this guy it could be something good I had a feeling about that lamp and I think I might be right, but this is really kind of funny. Ironically, or coincidentally I should say, when I was reviewing the footage that we had shot down Pacific Grove at the uh, antique store just a little bit before going through this locker, look at this lamp that I, what I found on the shelves. I didn't realize it at the time of course, but this is uh, a very similar looking piece. Unfortunately, I, since I hadn't found ours yet, I didn't realize the significance this would play, so I don't know how much it was asking. But I did a little research. So I think this is considered a flying saucer desk lamp, almost definitely a mid-century piece. And here's some comps for what they've recently sold on eBay. I'm pulling these comps off worth point, but depends on the maker. I'm gonna have to look at ours a little bit closer, but I'm glad I put it aside and didn't sell it because I think we have a nice little find here. These are nice. So that one does not work. Um, you know what these are? They're for shaving off little roly pulleys on your clothes. Uh, and they work great. I've got one. Whoa. Actually, it does work. <laughs> So funny they work great guys if you wash something you get those roly polies on your clothes they work really really good at taking it off it's a little squeegee for the windows i think we're gonna find a lot more tools in here what am i doing right now guys i'm just kind of grabbing things randomly i don't really even have a plan actually let's let's work on this right here let's get this cleared out actually let, let's go right in here and start grabbing some of the stuff that I was most looking forward to. So this right here, what we found so far, we found some nice art in the other one, packed away very well with shrink wrap and styrofoam. So I think this is probably art. No, I don't think it is art. Oh, it's a mirror. Dang it. It's <laughs> <is> not good. <laughs> Yeah, mirrors are a tough sell. All right, guys. Dun, 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 dun. A little drum roll here, guys. I was hoping this would be something good. I'm still hoping there's something good, but I mean, this is, this is, uh, I saw this on the shelf and I thought, okay, this guy maybe is a collector. Uh, I don't know. It looks like a box inside of a box now. Let's see what he's got. Okay. 
It's got a blanket protecting something. Oh, okay, whoa. Interesting. Okay, this, wait, that looks like an old camera, but I don't think it is. I think it's a, uh, like a sculpture. It's, it's metal, it's a metal sculpture of an old camera, but it looks like something's spilled into it. What's up with that? I don't know what's going on there. Look at this thing. It's neat, sort of, a little bit, sort of, kind of. This, everything's like, I don't know, it's a little dirty. Oh, uh, what is this? This this got some potential. I can op figure out how to open it. Here we go. Oh, okay, it says Quartz Germany. Oh, Bolova. It's a clock. All right, that's kind of neat. Yeah, it's cool. This box right here, we found similar boxes, similar shaped wood boxes. There we go. Yeah, it's all right. It's missing a little top right there. Not too impressed with that. It's just okay. A few more photos here. A bunch more photos here. Mm, this is a little better. Maybe. Maybe not. I see damage done right here. Uh, made in China. Never mind. Not impressed. It's cool. It's just not. Oh, what's this though? What's this though? What's this? That well, I don't know what that logo is, but it matches that right there. Uh, that's like a fishing knife. Browning. Okay. Yeah, that's sharp. All right. Okay, that's a good piece. We love finding knives. We'll put that aside. This stuff I don't think I'll put aside. A wooden anvil, huh? Okay. Oh. Oh, this is like a beanie baby. McGuire, Mark McGuire. Bambinos. We found those before. They're like a knockoff beanie baby sports theme. Here's some hockey pucks. Okay. I didn't find any uh, sports stuff in the other one. That, not that I remember. Ooh. Oakland A's baseball, and that's embroidered on. No signature, just a ball. That's neat. A little oil. Oh, that's maybe that's what's been leaking out onto everything. Maybe I'll leave that. Okay. Looks like a whole Nautica theme on his shelf somewhere. Harley money. <laughs> that's kind of neat. All right, guys, so we're going to be putting the better stuff aside, and I mentioned earlier that we do live auctions, and uh, I don't know about this stuff. It's kind of neat, just a little bit neat, but yeah, oh, that's cool. I think it's cool. A little troll. Made in Norway. Heck yeah. Interesting. Original knife form, NY form. That is something different. Anything from Norway, Sweden, I like it. It's like a pencil cup holder or something. Five dollars from Ross. Neat cork topper. And boat. <laughs> That's cool. And what's this? Camel. This is interesting, guys. This is. I like a little wood boxes full of stuff. Okay, this matches. I just got to make sure. Sometimes I find jewelry in them. Okay. Yeah, it's a neat little box. San Jose Sharks. Steve Miller Band, 1995. Oakland A's, 1998. Rolling Stones, 1999. San Jose Sharks, 97. Oakland Raiders versus the Kansas City Chiefs, 1997. Raiders versus Rams, Raiders versus Chiefs. Leonard Skinner, 97. That's pretty awesome. George Thorogood, yeah, bad to the bone. Sports, sports, sports. And some junk, junk, junk. Tina, it just says Tina. Is that Tina Turner? And if it is, she just passed away, so that might be, oh, I don't know, maybe a little collectible. This thing's got like grease or something on it. Maybe I'd let the wood box go. But I'll keep the tickets. Definitely keep this guy. What else we got? Oh, something's in there. And then this thing. Actually, this, this is kind of cool right here. It's like a boat shelf. What else we got? Oh, dang. Got more stuff. Made in China. No, thank you. Letter opener. Spoons or oars. Mini oars. I don't know what that is. All right, guys. I had a feeling about this box, and there definitely is some cool stuff. This I'll put aside. Oh, yeah, that's right. What's this? Oh, buttons. Okay. <laughs> the rest of it. Oh, look, it's got a broken leg. But the rest of it, I'm just going to let go. Even this thing. I'll let it go. 
let it go. I don't want to hold it back anymore. Okay, some gloves there. Let that go. I don't know what that is. It's kind of black wheel bearing grease. Oh man, that's that is not good. Let's zip that up and toss it. I don't know. This is good. Let's see some good tools in here. Oh, well, I see this. Purdy paintbrush. That's good to use, but these things will last quite a while if you take care of them. Okay. Nice. Ryobi laser level. Nice. This is good stuff, good stuff. All sellable tools. It's brand new. Alright, we'll let that we'll let all that go to the market. Next box. Okay, then we got a tarp, brand new tarp, 10 by 12. I'm gonna put that aside. I don't usually sell new tarps. You can always find something to upgrade, I would think. Okay, there's what some staples. What's this? I got excited last time I found one of these. Thought it was a magazine for a rifle or something, but nope. There's a knife sharpener. Not sure what that is. Okay. But this, look at this. Right below we got some interesting stuff. There's a blown glass ashtray, it looks like. It looks like a chip out of the bottom, but I'm not positive. Hmm. Huh. I mean besides that one parent flaw on the bottom, it's pretty nice. Love finding blown glass. Like it, like it, like it. Tool stuff. Ooh, what's this? Look at this. Craftsman Tools 1927 Sears Roebuck. Uh, main China though. <laughs> yeah. Okay, some screwdrivers. I don't know. This is neat. Crock pot. Some sandpaper. Oh, look at this. <laughs> that's... Wait, what is that? I thought it was a bong. That's just a vase. Okay, that's cool too. That's neat. Neat. Yeah, what's this though? Oh, we got some interesting... This is... I thought this was all tools. It is not. Alright, this is alright. Look at the way he packed this right here. It was all taped up. Some something made out of stainless steel. That took me a long time to unpack that. That I think is for cigars. I think it's an ashtray for cigars because it's so wide right there. And it's got a bulldog. That's kind of neat. Central Die Casting and Manufacturing USA Chicago. That's a little different. And you know what I always say, guys. I like the stuff that's different. So that's gonna make it to my keeper box. Okay. Ooh, this is heavy. Let's see more glass. Oh, that is beautiful. Gibson, 1935? What? No, it's gotta be 1985. That is beautiful. Oh, look at the worm inside the apple. That is neat. We're finding better stuff than this one. All right, it's just funny because we're finding like this kind of stuff mixed with tools. Yeah, but I like glass though, and that's, that's cool. This is the kind of stuff that Jenna and I would look for when we're out looking at uh, garage sales and we're picking. There's another beautiful glass piece. Looks like it's got a little chip right here, but it's not sharp. And uh, nice. Look at the bubbles in it. The bu I don't even know how they make that bubble pattern. That's special. Okay. Some kind of gauze in here. Alright, now look at this. There's a bell that hangs on the wall. This is the wall mount right here. Some sort of brass bell. I'll put that aside too. And then there's this. It's a lamp. It's cool. Whatever. I'll let it go. What do we got here? Alright, Gorilla Super Glue. I imagine that's hardened. And some more tools. Oh, got a, we got a visitor, guys. See the Janice car right there? 
Gianna's here. Huh? I brought gifts. All right. I could use gifts. I like gifts. <laughs> it's funny because we just found the glass and then Gianna shows up. And that's the kind of stuff she likes. Okay, I'm going to do a local plug for two local businesses. One, Story Coffee in Livermore, California. The best coffee ever. Yeah? Yeah, I highly, highly. Next door to it, I'm giving a shout out plug to my new favorite place. It's called the Cheese Parlor. Mm. And this oh, is wow. what I brought you as a gift. Wow. It's a cheese lunch plate. Oh, that looks so good. Does that look amazing? Yeah. I have some crackers to go with it too. Yeah. And I brought napkins to my house. You love napkins. I do. All right, guys, we're taking a lunch break, so uh, take a pause. We'll be right back. Okay, Jenna's ready to work. Cheers. Snack time is over. Hey, look what we need one of these. Aw, honey, you don't touch that. Should we take it home? It's like a Raider plunger. Look at that. Oh, that's cool. That's the construction of the Golden yeah. Gate Bridge? No. Yeah. No. Um, okay. Is it? I don't know. Is it the Bay Bridge? Yeah, maybe it is. Maybe it is. It's oh, the it's old just Bay Bridge. Bank of America. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's old Bay Bridge. Okay, maybe it is San Francisco. Huh, neat. Not worth anything. It's it's a low resolution, but Jana's seen this right here, and she saw it says knickknacks right there. Knickknacks, knick -knack. caddywhacks. That's bed, game. bed something. Bedroom. Oh, uh, okay. Bedroom knickknacks. It's not bed bugs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this blade sucks. Huh? Yeah, found it in the locker. So. Right. This is like silverware being a bedroom net bag. Okay. <laughs> so, what do we got here? A card. Card. Uh, more business cards. Oh, Jana, what's that? Uh, it looks like Mother of Pearl. Hmm. A. Something jewelry. Yeah, out of Missouri with a pearl pen through it, but it's nothing's in it. No. Let's see if that looks like where a ring would go. Could be. Cool box, though. The box is. Yeah. Oh, a marble. Your mouth. A good marble? Good enough. Yeah. Oh, I see something good. Got a penny. I think that might be the first money we found. Oh, don't show it. Um. Okay, next box. I'm now. Yeah. Kitchenware. That's weird. It's like yeah. A cork inside. That's a small uh, rolling pin. That's kind of cool. Rolling pins can be valuable. Can they? Yeah, people collect them. Knives. I can't see. That's, that's Japan right here. Yeah. We didn't do so good with our. That's the same brand as the one we just sold. Is it? Yeah, we're taking over to the flea market. Yeah, we didn't oh, really get that much. J. A. Henkel's. Yeah. Spain. Let's see if we can find any Germany, Taiwan, definitely flea market. China, even worse. China. That looks like a little better. I don't, I don't think so. Taiwan. Nah. I feel like they were waiting for this stuff for nice. That's right. <laughs> Japan right here. It's pretty. It's nice, yeah. It's, it's decent stuff, but ooh, it's France right here. That's cool. I like the shape of it. That's sharp, too. Mm -hmm. Is that something worth putting inside? All right. Is it all back? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Okay, now. Ooh, this is a jar fun. opener. Put it on oh, there. yeah. Cool. Nice, that will sell really well. Uh, Tabasco. Glass. Okay, so, but because I see some more knives in there. Yeah, this definitely is not bedroom mm. knickknacks. No. I was going to say this has been mislabeled. Maybe the box is reused. Okay, I see some knives in here. They might be better. Dude, here. Uh, he packed stuff so carefully. I've never seen a plate be used on a box. Okay, you see anything in here? It's just my silver silverware now. Not silver silverware, right? Probably not. Wow, that's sealed. Yeah, he went a little overboard a little bit. So, okay, that's made in the USA right there. Okay. Wherever. It's pretty warm. Yeah, it's not very sharp, but yeah. it's not the end of the world. They're not in great condition. USA Chicago cut cutlery that is sharp as. Uh, Hold it out. Yeah. Unless it's just plastic. Plastic. Simple. Okay. Well. All right. Grab the next one. Okay. Wedding gift. Just digging deep in there. Well, this is two and three and three and three. Yeah. So, handle with care. 
Yeah, sure we will. Oh my goodness, he taped it up. Uh -uh. Princess House, but right? Yep. I think it's Princess House. 100%. This Princess House is going to uh, Stockton soon. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Dang it. S sounds like all tools. Sounds like tools. Let's hope it's wrong. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't look wrong. Yeah, this is neat. Hang on. There's hope yet. Wait a second, Jonah. Yeah, there's some interesting stuff here. Okay. Hey, now camping stuff. A little soft. What else we got in here? This yeah, is good. Yeah. This is great right here. Ziplocs. Yeah, we're not using those. Oh. That's bed bug and flea spray. That's they love that in Stockton. That'll probably be one of the hot sellers right first thing in the morning. Really? Yeah. For real. Oh, this is kind of cool. Sea Land Mack truck. Somebody's custom jobber from the USA. That's neat. It's different. You won't find another one of those. Okay, that's about it. Yeah, the boots are cool though. Oh, what's in here? Huh. There's stuff in here. There's stuff in the boots. Oh, ratchets. Huh, that's cool. Flex clip. This material is for the red Ford pickup. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ooh, that's actually nice though. Alright, now, right here. Look at this Gerber. Oh, that's nice. Gerber makes a nice knife. And yeah, that's the right logo there. That's a Gerber. It doesn't say Gerber on here. Uh, but it's like a machete. Dang, that's nice. Ooh, it's sharp. Actually, the back side's sharp too, but this side's razor sharp. That's like some Arnold Schwarzenegger be wielding, fighting the Predator. Okay, now this looks like it's custom, maybe? Leather. Okay, there's a couple drill bits. I thought it was a purse, but apparently he's using it as a tool bag. There's some leather. For leather working. Look at this bag. What do you think about that? It's cool. Yeah, it's kind of neat, huh? I think it's handmade, yeah? Yeah, it's really pretty. Maybe. And then we got the Gerber. That's, that's good. Yeah, that's nice. Let's see what's in here. Dell computer. Dell computer. Dell cords and cables. It's just cords. I'm more impressed by the box than I am with the contents. Okay, that's good. That's for dogs, right? Dog leash? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's been chewed up. Okay. Yeah, find anything small that we could shove in there. Ooh, that's nice. That's a belt sander, like a handheld belt sander. That's cool. Ooh, it's Makita. 9910. Oh, dang, that's nice. Huh. Hmm. I you think it's... Okay. I just wonder if I should bring it somewhere better than Stockton, but it's all right. We'll let it go. What is this? This has got some weight to it. What the heck? You take on it. This guy needed to like lay off the tape. He had like too much tape. Okay, Visionary Fantasy 26. Do you know who that is? Is that somebody? Lady Gaga or something? I don't think it's appropriate. I don't think it's appropriate, huh? I, don't, I have no idea what this is. So weird, huh? It's a weird dude. <laughs> He's in some funky stuff. Wait, this is number 3700 in a limited edition of 6,000 numbered copies. Okay, and then he taped it all up. It's like, as if this were something, definitely didn't keep it in great condition. This is weird, huh? Yeah, I don't think it's a journal. Let me see Google Lines it. Maybe it's like photography or something? V26 Visionary, or Fantasy, I mean, it says Visionary. Gotta get this damn tape off of there. Here. How much? It said $349. $349 on Poshmark? What the heck? What is it? 
it, it's worth putting aside, right? Well, yeah, when I see that. Here's what we do, guys. We're gonna we put stuff in this bin, but we bring it home. We're gonna separate that stuff later to go to the Dianza flea market, or go into our live auctions, or in you know maybe on eBay or something. I don't know. Some of the weird stuff goes on eBay. Okay. Okay. I mean, Six thousand is not like super limited, but it's not that many either. Not sure how many people want those. Limited is just a subjective word, so uh, yeah, probably a small buyer pool. Oh, look at that, oh, two boy. more ship's wheel. Look at they got the ship's wheel right there. Does that one have like a clock or an altitude or some sort of? Okay. There's a cigar box here with rubber bands and disposable paintbrushes and paintbrush and more paintbrushes. Is there anything in it? Nope. Uh, look like there's weed in there. I found a whole bunch of that already too. Okay. That's interesting. Is that for the oh, toilet? Yeah, honey. You're really touching that. I don't think we need to sell used toilet brushes, yeah? Is that nice? Oh, this is nicer than the other one. Ship's time, it's a clock. The other one, it looks more like a real ship's wheel. This one is, I don't know. I don't think there any of them are used, but I think they're just... Water. This one's even nicer than that one. The vintage hazel uh, optical. 125 bucks. And cherished for the same one. Hmm. Okay. I don't think we're gonna get that. We could try. Ooh, that's neat. 1975 right here. Bugs Bunny. Great America. Oh yeah, that's gonna do well. That's a nice piece right there. And the yeah. color is really bright on it too. Yeah, it's neat. Let's see, what does it say something inside Unfortunately, of it? his teeth are broken off. He had bigger teeth. Oh, yeah. And it's broke right here, but that's a neat, that's a neat, though. And this is broke right here. It's a lot of damage. Looks like he had a lot of things going on. Wow. It's too bad. That's interesting. Yeah. Ooh, look at this. It's a pirate treasure box with a real sword on top. What do we got here? <laughs> okay, wipe and clear, biodegradable, wipes, some matches, oh, what's this? Oh, we found gems, gemstones, Jana. <laughs> we found a true treasure box, I think I have got an idea for a thumbnail. It says treasure box, right? Well, there's a treasure map, so. Look at that. He took a like a greeting card oh, made a exactly. treasure box. This is actually cool. Heck of funny. I, oh, and that's nice. 1978. Yeah, that's good. Let's see what this is listed for. This has got some good stuff in this box right here. Oh, okay, a bunch of steins right here. Look at that. Made in Japan, San Francisco, Stein. Okay. Budweiser. Oh, someone got in trouble. Oh, is it a ticket? Court order, probation. Budweiser. Budweiser. Uh-oh, someone wasn't being good. 1988. That's kind of neat. Look at that. I think that's a Dianza piece? That's cool. That's kind of neat. Yeah. It'd be an Alameda piece, maybe. All right, what next? Yeah, we're carving out some room in here. This one, maybe? That's interesting that, that uh, yeah, I know. What, what do you call that metal? I forget, but it's. I know, my, my aunt and uncle almost, had that. It almost looks like a cool. grocery store thing. That's exactly what I thought. And what's this? Looks like a safe. You didn't even mention that? I said that earlier. I thought to you heard me. Sure, no, I did not hear that you didn't <clears throat> say that. To ensure safe movement. Oh, copier. No, it's a copier stand. All right, on top here, a couple books. World Atlas and the great chart of world, wall chart of world history. Your favorite thing, large books. Yeah. The only thing worse than books is large books. It's kind of a cool little... Sharpening stone? Okay. It's old, huh? Yeah. Yeah, nothing even in it. Another one. That's a new thing, though. Birch Park. Yeah. Look at that. It's kind of neat. Poster. Outside the oh, lands. 2012. Yeah. Oh, Metallica, Stevie Wonder, Neil Young. 
Foo Fighters. Yeah, that's neat. That's it's a concert imagine. poster. Yeah, and it's in perfect shape. Yeah, that's a good sign. What else is he? He has like a little thing in here, I think, so it doesn't oh. bend. It looks like the rubber that goes it, on top of a turntable. It, it is. Underneath the record. So you got two of these right here. No, that's a different ship. Two, two very similar. Okay. The poster's cool. That's nice. Sailboat. Okay. Put that What's that one? Okay. All right, now this one. Okay. Oh, this is neat. A weather vane. Yeah, a weather vane. Yeah, it's very cool. Yeah, hey, bolt it down. That's, yeah, neat. that's neat. It has a cool patina on it. Yeah, I think we'll take that to Dan's if we yeah, make it. Yeah, for sure. Put it down there. Yeah, what's this? <laughs> something, okay. something broken? No, I don't think they are actually. Sounds broken, but they're not. I don't think it's worth anything though. Buttery? Cool. You like that? Rock in? I think it's two lids, right? Isn't that how it goes? No? Wow. No, maybe not. I don't know. They don't seem to lock on, I think. Maybe that is two lids, I don't know. Hot plate. Listed, $24. Okay, next box. This is kind of neat. It's different, because the way the edges are, it's like fabric that's been wrapped around the edges right there. Yeah. That's, that's actually kind of neat. I ain't gonna lie, I kind of like it. Hey, look how cool these are. For sale. Yeah. Got an what 80s color. I love that. Yeah. It's kind of different. It's copper. They got those little machines that go. Freaking engraved? I guess that's it, huh? It's cool. That is neat. I'm gonna yeah, put that aside. It's a little different. I like it. You don't want that to Oh, yeah, I guess we could. That's aluminum right there. A magnetic knife. Holder. Oh, this is that's alum this aluminum right here. That'll probably sell. Extremely sharp. This. Oh, it's a chopper. Yeah. Get to the chopper. Darts. What? Magnetic darts. Canister is kind of cool. Pyrex. Well, it's cute. I think it's like a beaker, isn't it? So what's in the very bag? Huh. So what? That you can take a peek, and I just want to see. That was ugly. <laughs> that must reach the market. My last box. Let's hope it's a good one. What are you gonna do with those shelves? Sell them. It'll be the first thing to sell probably in the morning. Yeah. All right, this is all glass. I'm hoping maybe some cool stuff. Paper. Yeah. Good For Julie. Good Julie. Okay. Yeah. Cool. They're kind of cool, huh? Mm -hmm. They're Very cool. Very cool? Yeah, let me see. Got them They're kind of mid century. 1988. Oh my goodness. That's the year I graduated. My parents are literally happy. They don't need more. That's kind of nice right here. This actually probably will sell at the better market. Yeah, this might sell. Do you think we should save this one for Dianza? I don't know. I hate bringing glassware out there. All right, Jana's had enough. She's going to head out. Yeah, thanks for having me. Thanks for the coffee. You're welcome. And the snacks. Have fun. Let me know. Call me if you find anything extraordinary. <laughs> all right. All right. Love you. Bye. I love you. Bye. All right, guys. We still got all this to go through. There's still some hope, but... We're finding like just a few goodies with a lot of blackies. <laughs> Blech. Nah. We'll keep looking. Uh, you know, I just thought it's going to be a good time to cap this video. Jana just left. I'm about to get into the rest of this. I've got about two hours to finish this. <laughs> now I feel like I'm going to be rushed. But I think it's a good time to end this video. We've been going for a while. We're finding some good stuff. I mean, some good stuff. Some Like I just said. Yeah, there's still a lot to get through. All this. So uh, let me cap this video and then we'll pick up right where we left off. You guys, I know you're going to have to wait a little bit for the next video just because we've got to edit it, but 
I'm not gonna have the way I'm gonna get right in it right now <laughs> but anyways guys thank you so much for watching I hope you're enjoying this locker it's I was hoping a little bit better I was hoping a little, just a little bit better I had bigger expectations than what it's produced but it has produced some neat stuff it's not been without finds I just wanted better finds and more finds but so far I mean like I only have like half a garbage can between the two lockers of trash everything else is going to go to market a lot of it probably won't sell but most of it will so it's still we'll make some decent money at the market they love tools really like I said earlier we're looking for the better stuff we want to put that better stuff in our live auctions and buy live auctions guys I know I didn't plug it earlier but I try to plug whatnot all the time because we've been doing these auctions almost every week whatnot our shows are usually on Thursday nights but always check our website lockernuts.com so you can see see when our next event is coming up we do the whatnot shows and whatnot's been just a fantastic match for us if you guys haven't tried it i invite you to go over there and check it out it's a lot of fun it's an app for your phone or tablet you can also do it on the browser but i suggest the mobile devices that's what it was built for and they built a great platform for live streaming auctions all right live auctions so go check it out we run a quick auction ours is a quick auction we show an item 20 seconds later it's sold all right we we show it we start the auction 20 seconds boom it's done well sometimes it goes a little longer because when people drop a bid at the last you know 10 seconds or whatever it extends the time but it's a very fast auction and as soon as it's done boom we got the next item out selling quick 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 and they make it so easy for you guys as buyers because oh i just say you guys but we're buyers too we buy from other people's auctions because we have fun there too really we buy uh, probably more stuff than i should because it's just fun and there's great stuff up for sale we sell great stuff too but i mean other auctions going all times of the day pretty much 24 hours a day seven days a week selling all sorts of stuff especially collectibles comics i mean I think the platform was built on like Pokemon and you know like trading cards and Funko Pops and I don't know it's just all this stuff that people are into I like the comic books personally Jana likes the jewelry but there's probably something for everybody on there but our show is a variety show we're gonna be selling well, pretty much everything that we find in the lockers at least the good stuff right maybe not the big stuff we won't be selling that mobility scooter right there but we're gonna sell anything that we can ship and uh, we'll invite you again invite you guys over to check it out and if you haven't checked it out before make sure you use our link all right we'll put the link in the description of this video but also on the website you can find uh, the link again that's lockernuts.com the link will be right there uh, use our link when you sign up for the first time because it's gonna get you $15 spending credit for free that's not something we're paying that's what whatnot's paying for you guys they're investing in you to try them out all right you don't have to spend it with us you can spend it with anybody 15 bucks your first 15 bucks is on the house basically so very generous of them and we're very happy that they're offering that to the locker nuts viewers okay but you got to use our link all right thank you guys so much for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one all right which will be out soon till then good luck to you god bless you and we'll see you next time here on locker nuts Oh, this is this is different. Oh, I like this. Okay, let's see what we got. Leather bag, first of all. It's definitely worn. It's kind of neat, though. Oh, look at this, guys. That is definitely vintage piggy bank. <laughs>